How's it going? Well, today is very, very dull and overcast. And we're coming towards the end of January, soon be February. Thought uh, we go for a drive. And we're going to see a ruined abbey, go for a drive down some country lanes and just enjoy some of the countryside that you haven't seen before plus a ruined abbey with a bit of a history to it so you ready come along with me then let's go i think i'll put some lights on it's uh it's a there's no wind out there at all today it's dead still the trees are not moving at all it's not a great i hope they take some photos today but the skies and the lighting isn't it's not really that great but if i can perhaps just get one or two it'd be nice but i don't like this kind of sky for photography it's it's what we call featureless there's no tones or no grays or blacks in it to break it up a little bit so i have to watch out for a very very narrow turning on the right hand side take us deeper into the countryside so here we go there's a turning here it's very narrow this is where we leave the little village of Ripley and we go further into the country away from the main road in the spring because it uh, really is one of my favourite places uh, for photography but just for a nice countryside walk because here now we we really are in the Surrey countryside pub here on the left called the, uh, the Seven Stars. They serve up a nice English roast meal there on, during the, the weekdays. But Sundays is a day like today when the families go out and they go out for a pub grub, have a meal and a drink. And it's where the family can get together and just all bond together in a nice, nice country pub. So we're coming up now to this bridge. And this is uh, known as Newark Bridge. Got a set of traffic lights here. It's very narrow, as you can see. So you can only get one car over at a time. And that's why it's controlled by traffic lights. So we have to be very careful. We're going over the, uh, the Way Navigation Canal, which looks actually really nice. Looks really nice. And we go past Newark Priory, which is on the right hand side. And we'll come back again and, and I'll get a few video shots of the place closer up. And I'll tell you a little bit of the history of the building. But down this road, not sure if we can actually turn into it we'll see is a very 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 old church it's a normandy church so we're actually in part of woking now we have to be extremely careful here because these bends are very very tight
very tight as you can see that corner there is, is extremely tight um, ah can we go into it let's have a look yes we can I didn't know that the door was open, so we are so lucky to be able to come inside this very, very old church. This is a very old church. I would imagine that this is a listed building as well. It's delightful. Lovely. Wow, so this church has been standing for well over 800 years. It's one of two old parish churches of Wisley cum Perford. In 1903 some Saxon foundations were discovered at Wisley near the present West Wall. St Nicholas seats 110 people. And the modern church, Good Shepherds, was built in Perford and was dedicated in 1964. The parish now supports all three and regular services are held in all of them. So over 800 years old. Wow. And you can see by the size of the walls I mean the concrete is very very thick, it's a very sturdy foundation. I'm so glad that we will be able to come inside and the door is unlocked. Yeah, it's very nice, very nice indeed. Now if this sky was a different colour and it was a sunny day without any wind at all. This would make a really beautiful photo, but it's nice nevertheless. So this is the Way Navigation Canal. And then you've got the bridge there. And as the canal goes underneath the bridge, it enters the wider and deeper river way. And you'll be on YouTube. Hello. <laughs> Are you all ready for the new year? <laughs> Did you get COVID or anything at all? Nah. You got away with it, did you? Yeah. So that's new at Priory. You get the right day in the sunshine, it can look amazing. So the priory you see here was established between 1189 and 1199 and it was disestablished in 1538 and it was dedicated to the Virgin Mary and Thomas Beckett. Eleven eighty nine. So that's why it's a listed building. But the other thing you don't know is that the grounds that surround it, you can't walk on them because they are very, very boggy. The ground is full of water and there's a good chance that you can sink. So this ruin is slowly sinking into the ground. You can't see the danger when you look at it from here, but I wouldn't walk on that ground because there's parts of it that you would just go straight under. So that's Newark Priory. <clears throat> Time now is just coming up to 20 minutes to 4 in the afternoon, p.m. And 
time for me to go home. And get a coffee. And edit this video. I hope you, uh, hope you enjoyed it. So there's a couple of places of uh, historic interest there. And um, yeah, it's getting very dark now. It's put my lights on. But it was just nice to get back out in the fresh air again and make another video for you folks. And I hope to be able to catch up with you again pretty soon. Uh, I'm out next Saturday. <clears throat> but I should be able to make a new video next, uh, next weekend. Um, hopefully. I'm not going to make a promise I can't keep that's not the thing to do but if uh, all being well I can get out next week I think there's um, a good chance of uh, another nature reserve a different one this time <coughs> which would uh, which should be nice but the forecast for next weekend believe it or not is rain yep all next week cloudy and sunny and next weekend rain somebody trying to tell me something I'm not very sure anyway I wish you all well welcome to the channel Wild Britain and I hope you enjoyed it and if there's anything you want to see you know any suggestions give me a shout and I'll get back to you and in the meantime thanks a lot for viewing and I wish you well. Bye-bye.